Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm back with a brand new video and it's actually going to be a first impressions video. So if you guys are interested in finding out my thoughts about this $3 micellular water, then please stay tuned. And also if you're not subscribing, don't forget to hit the button down below. That's gonna help you stay up to date with all my videos. So I'm just gonna jump right in here. I noticed at the Dollarama, which is the Canadian dollar store for those who don't know, um, they actually had micellular water. So it kind of caught my eye simply because micellular water is something that I love uh, removing my makeup with because it's just so easy to use and I find it doesn't dry my skin out. I'm a huge fan of it. Um, so this brand I've actually never heard of before. So I don't think they specialize in skincare. It's called Delon. It says it's dermatologist tested. Um, it's for face and eyes. It's a cleansing micellular water. They claim it removes makeup, cleans and soothes. It's oil free, fragrance -feet free and paraben free. Um, you get 235 milliliters. So I actually did the math and it's about, um, it's cheaper. I can't really like break it down right now, but it is cheaper than the Garnier one. Um, I forget all the numbers, but I just remember that this one was cheaper. So that's always a good sign. Um, and the ingredients are water, hexlin, glycol, gly uh, glycerin, disodium. I, actually, I'm not going to read anymore because uh, I can't pronounce anything. It's not tested on animals, so it's cruelty free, which is awesome as well. Um, so this is what the bottle looks like. It actually reminds me of the Bioderma stuff. I think it's probably just the color scheme they've used and the labeling. So I've never tried this, but I'm really interested. Um, I'm kind of noticing though there's, um, I don't know, you can't really, it's not picking up, but there actually seems to be some flakes in here. So I'm just going to shake it up. So I'm going to test it right now. Um, says it's an ultra mild formula as well. So I'll be the uh, judge of that. So I'm just gonna put a little bit on this cotton pad. It has no smell at all. Um, some of the other ones I've used have had a bit of a smell. So I'm just gonna remove my eye makeup right now. Um, this is from another video I filmed today, so you can see I have sparkles, so I'm interested to see how it's gonna take that off. Okay, so, so far there's still a little bit of sparkle left, but sparkles aren't really the easiest to remove. It's actually not working too bad. I didn't have any eyeliner on today though, so. Okay, so this is just from the eyes. You can see, this is kind of gross to show, but I'm gonna be realistic here. So this is from the eyes. So I'm just gonna zoom in here. Um, there's a little bit of glitter, but I think it took, uh, for the most part, everything off. I wasn't using like a cheap, um, like I had an eyeshadow primer on too and I had the Naked Heat palette. So they were good quality shadows. So I'm kind of impressed with actually how it's worked with removing my eye makeup off. I'm just gonna do my eyebrows, take that off right now. And see the difference. And I think it did a good job removing um, my eyebrow pencil. I wore the MAC one today. So another high kind of quality product. Yeah, so it didn't work too bad with removing my, um, so it didn't work too bad removing my eyebrow. Okay, so now I'm gonna try removing the rest of my makeup. I'm actually wearing a BB cream today, but it's a thicker one, so, um, yeah, that's just kind of some background. Uh, what else am I wearing on my face? Oh, I'm wearing the Balm Bahama Mama Bronzer, Becca Opal and elf the elf blush palette so we'll see how it removes um this so i'll start with my forehead 
Okay, it looks like most of the, this uh, makeup is off my face. I still do have a bit of sparkles. Just gonna try to, to see um, how it works getting my lipstick off. So I'm wearing the Makeup Forever um, liquid lipstick in 107, I think. Wow, it actually did a really good job of getting my liquid lipstick off. I'm impressed because this is not the easiest stuff to get off. It's a really like kind of harsh um, liquid lipstick. So Okay, so this is the final result. Um, don't have any makeup on my, left on my face. I am au natural right now. So I have to say, I'm actually really impressed with this micellular water. I thought it might be kind of a miss, but I think this actually works better than the Garnier stuff. Um, I'd say like even the simple stuff as well. So this is something definitely if you do see it at your Dollarama, you need to pick it up. It's only $3. It is, it removes your makeup. Like glitter, you might need a little bit more, but for everyday looks that you're not wearing glitter, I have like nothing left on my face. Um, I did get a little bit in my eye too, and it didn't burn. So that felt really good too. So Delon Micellular Water, you are a hit. Um, like I said, pick this up, definitely worth the money. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know if you'd like to see some more skincare um, videos, or maybe if you'd like me to test some other dollar store products, let me know. But um, don't forget to subscribe. Let me know your thoughts on this video down below. And I hope you have a great day. Thank you for all your support.